Hello everyone, my name is Lindsay Denny and I am a CSU Pueblo student intern. I'm so excited today because I get to offer students a fun math activity to try out at home while we are practicing sheltering in place. This activity is like Battleship, but instead of playing Battleship, we're going to be using a hundreds chart. So it's going to be a little bit different. This activity follows standard one for first grade number and quantity. I hope you enjoy this video. So for this activity, students are going to need a hundreds chart that they will be using. They'll need to know the basic rules of Battleship because we're still going to follow the basic rules of it. They're also going to need some counters or something to mark their ship or number on their numbers chart and something to separate two students. So let's go ahead and get started. First things first, my two students are going to have to mark five ships and place them wherever they want on their hundreds charts. Remember one ship is two squares, another I think two ships are three squares, and one ship is five and we'll make the last one another two squares. So you'll we'll need... So this is kind of how it should look like. I'll zoom in for you. So as you can see there is one five squared ship, two are three squared ships, and the last two are two squares. So students are going to take turns asking like is your ship 15 and they could say no and then he would then have to draw an X on number 15 to know that he did not hit a ship if they sink a ship or if they hit one I'm gonna want them to color in the square to differentiate whether they hit or they didn't So if a student or your child hits a ship and their ship gets sunk, I had my cross it out with a straight line to signify that their ship was sunk. And you're just going to keep playing until someone wins. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoy this activity. It is super fun and it's just like Battleship except for Students are going to be learning their hundreds chart, seeing, okay, what number's covered up, how can I tell what number might be next, just different things like that to keep their number sense going. Again, thank you for watching. Stay safe out there, and I hope you enjoyed this video.